All right, Todd's here for the final full week of October. Wow, oh, wow. In the month, like, you know, it's a long month. It, it, and it's 31 but days. It went, but it's zipping right by. Yeah, it, it really is. Yeah. Also, um, by the way, like, I think I went to sleep in 1995, and now it's 2022. <laughs> Like that's how fast time flies. Yeah. Like not just oh. that it's October. You're but talking about life. In October yeah. of wow. 2022. We just took yeah. this to a very different yeah. place. Yeah. Now, now I'm getting life <laughs> flies by. I, yeah. Now I'm gonna get right. emotional. Like, I know, my, my right? Kids are getting older. <laughs> start, my, my kids just turned 13. I, I mean, it's like, just what? so fast. It's just next year's high school. Crazy. Your kids are, you know, okay. adults. But listen, Grown-ups. this is why you yeah. have me. I will lend you some of mine. I'm here for you. I'm we, a giver. That, I don't think that's what we said. I, oh. I didn't ask for no. more. That's what I, just, I heard. That's what I heard. Yeah. That's what I heard. We're just, we're just, you know, just reflecting. We could do on like it. a rent to own. <laughs> rent to own. <laughs> wow. Uh, but can we give them back, like at you know, young adult life, right? Just before they decide to go to trade school or college or whatever, and they get real expensive. Uh, so the Pats play tonight, Monday Night Football. Uh, it's kind of interesting. You know, they're sneaky good right now, and they've got another W in their future probably. They're playing the Bears. Bears stink. Uh, 60 degrees, cloudy, little drizzle, but most of the rain should be moving out of Gillette area and moving up toward us. We are in this flow again where moisture's coming up from the south almost has a tropical element to it. So it's going to be pretty unsettled these next few days. Periods of rain that may actually be on the heavy side. Right now it's steady and even where it's not getting picked up, there's mist and drizzle falling. Uh, so it's a wet start for the state. Eastern Maine radar seeing some light rain and drizzle at the very least, maybe a little steadier on up toward Lincoln. A few blips of yellow. I expect more of those as we head into the middle of the day. Flow coming in off the water, so that's adding the moisture. Warm front lifting it, that's your recipe for rain to fall. This low will actually weaken tomorrow, so we won't have much rain tomorrow, but it'll start off a little drizzly. And then a second low comes up in this flow for Wednesday with another round of drenchers. Light rain and drizzle for your morning drive. It's slick out there too with the leaves. I mean, it's not like they're on every road, but if you're, you know, un go under a tree, like the maples right now seem to be releasing their leaves the most. So it's, uh, it's definitely a little slick. You got to be using uh, some caution out there and just keep that in mind. Wet with some rumbles possible midday, sub severe, but a few heavy downpours out there. And then during the afternoon and evening, a lot of the heavier showers will be lifting out of here. We don't exactly dry out though. There still will be drizzle falling this evening and mist falling this evening. So it'll be a challenging evening commute too. And part of that is because sunsets are at 530. So now the second half of our evening commutes are in the dark and you add wet leaves and a little mist to the equation. And that's going to mean some extra minutes on your ride home. They are highs today, pretty normal but it's going to feel a little raw with winds off the water. So that low weakens tomorrow. Sadly, limited, if any, sunshine with the onshore ingredients there, the flow. And then here comes that next wave of low pressure on Wednesday. More heavy downpours. Finally, a clean sweep with a nice cold front for the end of the week. We get back to sunshine. Yeah, crisp and cool, but it should stay sunny for the entire upcoming weekend. And there's all kinds of Halloween fun going on this weekend. So that's great news. The first wave of rain today into tonight, probably about an additional half an inch. The second one may end up drenching Eastern Maine with another inch and getting up close to an inch in Southern and Western areas. So this would be like the third or fourth week in a row where we had some sizable rain and that's eliminated the drought and that pattern isn't breaking right now. So we don't have an extended dry stretch at any point. There's your marine forecast. The visibility will be terrible out there and yeah, there'll be some rain. Cool and wet 50s tomorrow drizzle in the morning and then just mostly cloudy and warmer 60s. That next round of rain on Wednesday during the day high 58 and then a sunny stretch Thursday through Sunday and it does turn a little milder by the end of the weekend as well. Not bad. All right, bad. Look, looks good once mm. we get through this yeah. next three days. Yep. <laughs> We've done it before. We have. Thanks, sir. Three, 